Yo, what is up, my crazy subscribers? This is Joe King John 64 here, bringing you guys a Black Ops 1 gameplay. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it because I know, you know, like I've been saying for the past, I don't know how many videos, this will probably be the last time you're ever gonna do this kind of stuff. I mean, now we got jetpacks and all that bullshit going on. I mean, I would have, if I would have want to play a futuristic game, I would have gone to Halo or Titanfall or Destiny. So. There was really no need for uh, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare to really go that beyond of a futuristic game because I don't think it really needed to. Because I think Call of Duty should just stick to the competition between Battlefield and Call of Duty itself. I mean, that should have just been it. Don't get involved with other games like Halo futuristic stuff because you, really, you don't really need it. Though. All you need to do is just beat out EA because right now EA for sure has a throne of modern combat. That's what I see right now. So anyways guys, more information about the gameplay. I was using the AK-74U, you know, my classic legendary gun. Uh, my class setup is still the same. I haven't changed anything since I've gone back. Like, nothing at all. I leave it how it is and that's the last time, you know. Whatever, whatever, however I used it the last time, that's how it is right now. Then, that's pretty much how, you know, I'm using it right now. I mean, I remember this kind of style before and it took me a while to get used to it and, um, God damn, I ended up owning. And it took me like around four or five games to actually get used to my kissing for you again because the accuracy is quite terrible. I don't know how I've managed to actually be in top 15 in the whole world in domination and TDM, but I managed to do it with the AK-74 U. A lot of people, I know some of you guys will actually laugh at my class setup with the AK-74 U because it does have rapid fire. And um, the thing is that the reason why I did the rapid fire is because I wanted to get instant kills. I wanted to reload as quick, as quick as possible. I wanted to run it out there like as quick as possible. Also, I wanted to be the quickest guy out there, and that's why I created this class setup. In no way have I ever copied any class setups. There's no way. I bet nobody has this class setup. Nobody. I promise you that. I'm the only one who has the AK-74 with the rapid fire. Lightweight, slight of hand pro, and uh, marathon. I mean, that's the quickest setup you can ever have. And, um, you know, I pretty much did pretty good in this gameplay. I mean, this could give you like a little taste of what I used to do back in Black Ops 1 because I know I didn't record anything. Well, that, there was actually some few gameplays here in the recording YouTube, but they're all scattered around. Uh, at least few of them are Madden All Stars. Um, one was actually in the old channel of Madden All Stars, which is uh, no longer active. Well, I think it's around, but what I'm, I forgot the name of it. Um, another gameplay is recorded by a clan member that I used to be, uh, and I used to be in the clan before. It's called, it was called Toxic. The guy has my gameplay of me sniping. I went like 54 and 3 or something like that. It was a pretty cool, cool gameplay. I ended up calling the chopper gun and several stuff. But, but yes, it's somewhere around there. So for sure, for sure, right now, guys, I have like 10 gameplays in total of Black Ops 1 of what I used to do. So uh, when it was um, when Black Ops One was actual, it was the actual game to play on. I mean, Black Ops One was shit for me, and this is where I started because it is a funny story how I started because um, I used to just play sports games, Madden, you know, you name it, Madden, Two uh, K, NBA, and all those kinds of sports games, and I wasn't really into FPS. I, w <laughs> I really wasn't. I hated FPS when I played Red Faction. Red Faction was my first FPS, and um, it wasn't really my kind of style. And I was like, you know what? Fuck FPS. I don't really like it. And then I stepped over one day because my, my brother bought this game for me. And I was like, I don't even like FPS. Why'd you buy it? So I tried it out. The first three games that I stepped in, it was like over 30 kills. And I was like, how am I doing so good if I don't even play this fucking game? And I don't like FPS. So I got used to it like too quick, and I was so good in the beginning. And I was like... How am I doing this? I don't even play FPS. I like racing games. I like fantasy games like Final Fantasy and you know RPG, MMOs, you guys name it. Where the fuck did this FPS skill just came out of like it just came out of nowhere? It, it really surprised me. It really, it really took took it by storm because I was like, why am I so good at this? I should have started since Call of Duty 4. So um that's where I expanded to my own channel back in uh, 2011. And um, I created this channel right when Modern Warfare 3 was, was released. Actually, I waited like around four months to actually make my own channel and uh, post some tips and strategies and stuff. But uh, it was cool though. I wish I would have started from this point because I know a lot of people would have subscribed. 
I mean, my class setup for Beast, the, the Famas, my Galil. Uh, several of my classes were pretty much useful um, in battle. A lot of people really liked it, and the, especially the AK-74 for you. And if I would have showed my little boards, a lot of people would have been convinced. Because right now, of course, I don't have any evidence, but my evidence is on the phone that I used to have, and I still have it. And it's saved there when I took the picture when I was ranking the top 15 of both the TDM and Domination. It's just that the battery doesn't work and the phone doesn't want to turn on. So it's literally screwed, you know, that picture. <laughs> so I have no evidence, but I have one guy who actually saw the whole thing happen. And, you know, I showed him, the, I told him to go to the top of the leaderboards, and it was true. I was ranking both Domination and Team Deathmatch in the top 15 in the whole world for a whole week. You guys were really surprised. I'm not sure if it was uh, RMCIM or some other guy that I used to have. I know two people saw it, but I, I forgot which one is the one who sticked around uh, and actually saw that thing. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay. A lot of pop-ups, a lot of, you know, crazy-ass movements around here in the map.